All right, what is going on everybody? It is Tristan and today in this video, I got something very simple for y'all. We're just gonna discuss some of the upcoming shoes, some leaks, things like that that we have recently. And there shouldn't be too much background noise going on. Again, uh, I live in a shared household, so keep that in mind. But uh, my camera's pretty good. The mic should be fine, so we shouldn't have any issues with that. But I hope you guys will enjoy. Again, if you want more content like this, feel free to check any of my Instagrams, any of that down below. Of course, you can go follow kind of the business page. Been working on the group here. Had some great success on the Neckface SB system. This morning i've been buying up some pairs of these just since i think they will be a great hold but y'all can see here are some of the members uh, that we had hit this morning on that shock drop we knew about it last night so way beforehand if you're interested in early nike info backdoors daily under market pairs again i dropped 10 deals 10 plus deals i think yesterday all under market things like one dollar uh like t-shirts you can sell to stock x for like 30 40 dollars profit things like that i'm always trying to help people make a profit so that's in our group if you're interested in that learning how to buy anything it's all there so go give us a follow check us out down below and if you want to join go to the wait list right here join it and uh, yeah that'll be there top of the description or pinned comment so that's all i gotta say i hope you all will enjoy it and let's just kind of get started here so first things first again when you go and look in this this is a upcoming sb collaboration in 2023 uh with fly streetwear as you guys can see and overall i like the colorway on this one it looks very nice definitely a wearable one and as to how SBs have been performing recently, these are going to do very well. I mean, the SB hype is definitely there. I've been buying SBs. It's just that they're going to continue to do well. I haven't been buying like older models. I've, I've sold off a lot of the older ones, like green apples, things like that, because those are at like $300. It just, it's a good point to sell in my opinion. But ones like this, that'll start at like 200, like, like the neck face is at like 190, 180, between like that and 200, 210. Those are going to be very, very good ones to look out for, uh, you know, for the future, if you're just trying to hold on to them, or if you're just looking to buy a pair now is the time 100 for the neck faces in my opinion just because we have the most stock that's released we have the shock drop people are going to be looking to sell pairs that's what i'm saying you can probably find a pretty good deal from someone that got uh, a pair from sneakers just trying to kind of make you know a quick flip profit so i would check ebay check instagram check the discord group we got people selling pairs in there so if that's something you're interested in check your local area facebook marketplace all that you know skate shops have dropped their pairs so it's always good to look. But yeah, aside from that right there, and this one, Flash Streetwear, just the first one I kind of wanted to show you guys. Very wearable, really liking this one, loving the suede around the toe box and kind of back by the heel here. And along with kind of, uh, I guess, I'm guessing this is like the Flash Streetwear brand logo, potentially. Again, something else there. It's nice to see. So aside from that, another one here that I can show you guys. These are just some of the upcoming, I've discussed a lot of these, but these are just, again, some of the upcoming releases uh, recently, you know, for holiday 2022. We got the Chicago uh, twos coming up. We got these, I believe, I, I know there's, it's, it's like gold. Gorge Green, I believe. The Gorge Green one's coming up. Uh, some nines. I believe these have already released. Of course, cannot forget about the Lost and Founds. The demand is insane, and these dropping tomorrow. Definitely going to be giving, uh, getting some pairs of those. So, just some ones I wanted to show you guys. And then also, don't forget, these are the Spider-Man Jordan 1s leaked. Again, apparently going to be dropping in 2023. Summer of 2023, as you guys can see there. And I'm liking the color one. This one definitely going to be one that does well. I mean, ones are a little bit dead right now, but I just think due to the fact that it's a collaboration and it's like, you know, with a kind of a a more uh popular kind of a I, I i wouldn't say like not not celebrity but like you know kind of like i guess like an action hero something like that it's gonna do well so you know it has kind of its own uh you know community of people that'll be interested in it but also you know it's something uh it's connected with another very popular community there's a lot of people that like spider-man you know what i mean so it's it's going to do well for that basic fact in my opinion so just definitely look out for it not the first time they've done a spider-man jordan one if i'm correct so just another one to add to the series coming in 2023. Not bad. But aside from this, another one, again, I can mention right here, we're going to get into that. This is some of the upcoming 2023 releases. Apparently, we have another colorway of the Off-White Air Force Ones coming. And these right here, again, these Jordan 4s are going to be an amazing pair. Uh, definitely going to do well. Same with the Olives right here. A lot of these can do well. You know, Panda SBs. Uh, this is, I believe, a sample, if I'm correct. I don't believe this colorway is confirmed. I, I, if I'm right, it is a sample. But then, you know, apparently, there'll be a rerun of the Thunders. We've known about these ones, the SBs. Jordan 4s. A few of the ones that are confirmed are like these three. These three and this one I think is pretty close to being confirmed. Hopefully it will be. Hopefully we will see someone with like a retro pair uh, an early pair soon of those. I would really like to see it done for the Thunders since they've already done it for the Red Thunders. Why not do it for the OG Lightnings? You know, uh, well not Lightnings but you, you know what I mean. It would be nice to see these redone since they've already done another colorway for them. So aside from that another basic one I can show you guys. Don't forget these drop today. Neckface SBs. Just kind of want to discuss it real quick. A really good hold. Very 
very, very good hold for the future. So do not miss out on it. That's all I'm saying. There is a lot of opportunity to hold this one, in my opinion, especially in those bigger sizes like 11 plus. They're lower in price right now, kind of like between 200, 220. You can find a lot of people selling them locally for like 190, 210. Again, if you live in a bigger city, it's much easier to do that. But if you live in a smaller one, just check your online area. The Discord can be very useful for that since you can connect with more people. So again, on the website down below, if you want to check that out, get in the wait list. But aside from that basic fact right there, another one, aside from the neck faces, since we've been discussing these, uh, an upcoming one, the Zion Jordan 1 Low. I do not want to forget to discuss this. I will have a how-to cop coming for it, I think tomorrow, if not tomorrow, then the day after. Some Sometime soon, you guys will be seeing that for this release right here. And it is a higher retail, but I don't think it is going to be a break due to the fact that it is reselling pretty well right now. And there has been a decent amount of sales. There's a good amount of pairs out there. And it seems like it's holding up decently well. It seems like there's actually some folks that want these. It's overall a nice pair of Jordan 1 Lows. I think, I think people rock with them. I know some people aren't feeling them, but I feel like in hand, these would be a lot nicer. So I'm definitely going to be trying to get a pair to, you know, kind of get an in-hand review and something like that. So yeah, aside from that, he only had, a, I think this comment's great. Only, only 88 career games, $170 price. Yeah, bro. Nike is definitely taxing. There's zero doubt on that. They're just trying to run off the hype, but you know, they're going to do the thing. They love their money, man. Yeah, that's what it is. And another one right here again from Nice Kicks. I agree with the total fact uh, in the comments that everyone's stating right here that they should not have started out with these. I don't know why Nike started out rerunning the foam posits with this model right here. I don't think it's the right one. I, I, I personally think they're pretty mid ones to start with. And a lot of people have kind of, you know, said uh, these aren't valid. Uh, Nike just do it right. Nike starts with that. You know, people are just aren't really hyped, uh, you know, with these ones dropping first. But, you know, you see some people that are like bring back the OG colors, best foams in a while. So some people are liking them, but it's overall, you know, kind of 50 50, it seems like in the comment section here. So I think they definitely could have done a better one, probably a more hyped one for the first foam posit, but that wasn't what they went with. So there you go. And finally, this is a sample one I just wanted to show you guys. So there you go. Not coming soon, but yeah, just a sample pair of some lobster uh, SBs they did. Wish they would release this, but yeah, kind of nice. And then finally, don't forget the Black Phantoms coming soon, of course, hopefully. Uh, in I think they said December of this year, this one's going to be releasing 60,000 stock, but you know how it is. A lot of it's going to go through the back door, so don't expect to see uh, you know most of it. That's really how it is. But if you hit in this pair, definitely something I'd be very happy about. You'll be making a great profit. And the, the, the this one, uh, excuse my beautiful stutter right there, but this one has definitely grown on people 110%. Zero doubt about that because a lot of people are feeling all black. They kind of rock with that theme and they feel like it's a lot easier to wear. But I think the in-hand uh, in-hand pictures have helped build the hype for this one a little bit more gotten people to like it a little bit more but overall seeing a variety of travis scott jordan one low colorways nothing shocking expect to see more this is what they're going to do so that's all i need to say right there again if you want to check my instagrams any of that down below feel free go check out the business page again if you want you see everything we offer right here you can go check out our success uh this is just like some of the examples of pairs we dropped in daily deals all under market prices so people can make at least like 20 or 30 dollars off the item if not more yesterday i dropped off white dunks for 400 dollars so somebody is going to make like $200, $300 off those. I've dropped unreleased sneakers. I, I'm going to be dropping the Amamani Air Force. It got lost and found on Monday. So again, tons of things that you guys can, uh, you know, invest your time into. And again, tons of things we have in the group. We have a guide that kind of runs you through what everything does, how you can profit from it. It's good. So again, check it out if you want to get in the wait list and we should let you in today, but that's it. So if y'all want to, that's there. I'll see y'all in the next one though. Hopefully, is isn't too much background noise. I'm going to end this video. I'm Tristan. Thank you, guys. And hopefully, I will catch you all in the next one soon. Peace.